Hey everyone, Jeff Teague at Friday Anderson Toyota. Today I'm going to show you the brand new Toyota technology, Qi Wireless Charging. What that allows you to do is set your cell phone on a charging pad in the car and it'll start charging while you're driving. I will show you how to set that up and then I'll show you for iPhones and for droids how to buy the necessary hardware so it will be Qi enabled and that way you can use it at all times. Hope you like it. Here's how the Qi wireless charging works in a 2015 Toyota. In this case, I'm using an Avalon. Let's go down here to our e-bin storage. Here's our Qi wireless charging pad. To open the e-bin, push it forward. To close it, you also push it forward, then it releases. Let's leave it open. And down here, you'll see the Qi wireless charging button. So push this button here. That turns it on. My phone is not compatible because I don't have extra hardware that's needed. I have the Samsung Galaxy S5, but for demonstration purposes, let's put it on our pad here. Okay, when it's charging, two lights will light up. Either a yellow light if it's charging and a green light if it's fully charged. Next, I'm going to explain to you how to make both a Droid and an iPhone compatible and Qi enabled. Since this is newer technology, most droids and all iPhones are not going to be Qi compatible. In other words, you're going to have to get additional hardware, for example, back covers for the droid and a receiver card for the iPhones. Here's a website I found. I'll give you the link. Qinside.biz. It's going to tell us which phones are Qi compatible and which ones are not. So let's find our iPhones first. And just like I said, the iPhone 4, 5, and 6, it says additional equipment is needed. I'm going to show you where to find that. Now let's scroll down and find the Samsungs. This is kind of interesting because, let's see if we can find it here. The Samsung S6, that is Qi integrated. You already have your equipment that you need for it. Now, if we scroll down just a little bit further, the Galaxy S3 and the S5, you're going to need additional equipment. Okay, now I'm going to show you where to find this equipment. Okay, I did a little research for everyone here so you know what hardware to pick up. For the Droid devices, you'll want the wireless charging battery cover and it fits right in place of the back battery cover on your current phone. The only warning I'll tell you is I have read some reviews. It looks like it changes the shape of the, v, uh, of the uh, device, makes it a little bit bigger, so be careful if it'll fit your current case or not. The price seemed real reasonable, $21.99. I found a similar device, the Samsung wireless charging cover. Price seemed real reasonable at Best Buy. I'm not sure if that's online or in the stores, but I'll bet you could either get it online or actually at the store. And then what I did was I went to Amazon for the iPhone device, and it's the Qi wireless charging receiver, and it fits the iPhone 6 and the iPhone 5. Uh, feel free to go to the stores and ask the folks at Best Buy and I'm sure they can hook you up with the right equipment. Remember as soon as you put that cover on the back or the receiver on the phone all you have to do is lay it on the Qi wireless charging pad in your Toyota and push the button and it'll start immediately. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you found this video helpful. I have many other Toyota related videos and I'll see you next time.